All right, here we go. Question number six from our 0314 homework number two in my lab math. They want us to graph the equation by plotting points. And so over here, I've already got the equation written down, y equals uh, 6x minus 3. And what we're going to do is we're going to use a table of values where I've already picked 0, 1, and 2. You can pick anything you want. I just decided for 0, 1, and 2, just be, I don't know, just because I felt like it. And we'll see if those plug in and work and give us points that we can actually plot. Okay, so here's how this works. Starting with 0, we're going to plug in 6 times 0 minus 3. Notice what I did there is I replace x with 0, whatever that works out to be. That'll be my y coordinate. So 6 times 0 is 0. 0 minus 3 is minus 3. And then we're going to do the same thing with 1. 6 times 1 minus 3. That's going to be 6 minus 3, which is 3. And one more time, 6 times 2 minus 3. 12 minus 3, which is 9. And then we're going to say, hey, these first two points, those are pretty small and pretty easy to plot. And so now we're going to come over to the graph and we're going to plot those. So here's how you use the graphing tool. Uh, you can either click this, which says click to enlarge the graph, or you can just click right on the graph, which is what I'm going to do. And you're going to want to select the line tool. And then notice down here it says click the graph to plot the first point on your line. And so the first point I'm going to plot is 0, negative 3. 0, negative 3. Where is that at? Is that there? 0, that looks like 0, negative 2, which is not exactly where I wanted that. And then the other point is 1, 3. Now I plot the other point, 1, 3. That is not probably, that. I don't feel confident about that at all, okay? So let's say you don't like that. You can click clear. And let's see what happens if we choose this tool. Here we go. Let's try this, okay, with the line tool. Oh, now look up here. Now you can see the ordered pair that you're at. This is actually a little better, okay? So click the graph to plot the first point. We can see that that's 0, negative 2. There is 0, negative 3. So if I click, I feel really confident that that's at the right point. And then the next point we're going to plot is 1, 3. So there I'm at 1, 3. I'm going to click and save and check. There you go. So there's graphing a line, and notice that it only takes two points. I didn't even need this third point. That was just extra. I hope that was helpful. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to put those in the comment section below, or you can text me. And thanks for watching.